Welcome back to another version of Fortnite Rewind. In this version, we're going to drop the steel farm over here, mainly because I need to get a bounty, and I know there's a bounty board over here. And secondly, I don't know how many times I have dropped this location. The previous year, the daily challenges were always kill somebody at the pizza pit, so I seem like I was always dropping here. So I'm familiar with the place. So we're going to drop here, see what we got, get looted up, and, and see how the game goes. What's funny is, uh, man, there's nothing better than landing in a spot and there not being any chests to spawn there. That is such a cool thing. And then you go and you find a gun, and then you start looking around for other guns, because at least there's a gun on the ground. And it's all the same gun. So I hope you really get a gun you like. There's nothing better than, yeah, getting like an SMG, and nothing but SMGs like I'm getting here. Or, you know, you could get... Shotguns and nothing but shotguns. That's more handy for the early game. But yeah, good time. So I'm going to loot up here, and then we're going to get our bounty, and then we're going to go see what's out in the world. We're running around when we hear some gunshots. Let's explore, see what's going on over here. And it's a guy chasing a llama. Let's sneak up on him and uh, make his day a little more unhappy. Okay, that was, uh, that was, uh, interesting. Okay, let's rewind that fight. The battle starts off well enough because I'm able to get a couple cheeky shots, 120, 130 damage, uh, because he's distracted by a llama. And then I go and fail to build. And since I build poorly, I just, I'm going to spray him. Uh, not very effective at the spray, so I'm going to try to build again. Yeah. <laughs> twice that is so bad i finally build up and we meet at the top exchange some fires and head our separate ways he builds to protect himself i'm still kind of just stuck unable to build try to get a cheeky little jump shot in unable to spray a little bit more he comes down and we get into a jumping fight i'm able to get out my combat shotgun hit him once twice good shot there and then he starts to try to spray me and i finish him before he can get done spraying me very lucky to win that battle no doubt it was, uh, that was uh interesting he had a better shotgun than me yeah we're not gonna lie he uh he should have killed me uh yeah yeah that was i was lucky to come out of that one if i hadn't snuck up on him yeah i wouldn't have gotten that kill Okay, that was, um, bad luck for that dude. He was a better, much better player than me. And now it is time to get third party. Fortunately, it was just someone who wanted to have a spray battle. Somebody can obviously hit me. Ah, <sighs> goodness. Let's gather up the loot and move onward. Myself and Corny, I see a little player over by the building over there. I'm gonna get off a couple cheeky shots on him. Stop! What? What? Stop! Did you see that car come out of nowhere? <laughs> Rendering issues. Good times. Good times. Build a wall. Ramp up. Just kind of. I think it's a bot, so I kind of finish him off. And we uh, go collect his loot. Then I'm going to head into a bush, kind of regroup, get the uh, weapons resituated, and check out where I am with the storm. 
I don't think there's a better feeling in Fortnite than having to see you have to go all the way across the map between storm circles. So I have to get going, make double time, get up behind Lazy, try to find some high ground, see what's going on in Lazy, kind of coming in that back door when I get shot at. Yeah. Unfortunately, the storm's coming at me pretty good. And so rather than fight right here, I'm just going to, yeah, let's just go ahead and yeet on over into the circle. Find some high ground for myself. Uh, whoever that was who shot at me decided to take the low ground. Bit of a mistake. Uh, yeah. Didn't work out very well for him at all. <laughs> From here, I work my way up besides Misty Metal, gathering the high ground above. Just trying to see where people are. And yeah, look, there are people coming in from the circle there. And there's a second guy who's kind of building right down below. So there's two of the three people that are left in the game. So I'm just going to keep my eye on them at this point. I, I don't see them really moving at this point. So I like, there's a pot down there. Uh, let's go get full shields. So I'm heading down here to get full shields. Come down here. Pop the med or the the big pot I go ahead and gather some ammo here and as I begin to kind of head back up to my high perch spot after I gather those resources I see footsteps and that guy comes rolling in and uh yeah wow let's stop and let's rewind this the guy comes in hyper aggressive I'm able to pump him for 62. I've started building walls, which is a mistake. He's spraying me with his AR, and I get a second pump off and finish him off at 97. I guess the pump beats a spray AR in this instance. There went all my shields. The process of that. Now I find myself in the high ground above Misty. I'm looking here for the other two opponents. There's two people left. I see the one guy. He's kind of building over top of those buildings over there. I still don't know where the second guy is, so I'm just kind of sitting here waiting on it, and I'm just kind of watching this guy build, and then I have a brain fart. I'm going to knock his builds down. He'll fall and take damage. I'm like, no, he's not. He's on top of a roof. Really, really stupid play on my part, because now but he and the other player know where I am, and I only know where one of them are. The storm is coming in, so I need to make my way down the hill and try to get into the circle. The bottom of the hill, I see the guy build a wall, come out from behind the wall to see if I can get a shot on him, hit him for 79 with the pump. He tags me with the rail gun. I go in, all in, I got my pump still. I come up, I pump him in the head, 97, and we're done. Freeze. Here is where I make a fatal mistake. It's the right idea to heal here, but I really should have, like, built myself in, maybe gone up a level or two and locked myself in before I started healing because the other guy's coming. I should have known better. I, it's not like I don't have any mats. I'm like pretty much max mats across the board, but yet I decide to just heal behind this little bitty wall and what you'd expect to have happen. Guy comes in and absolutely claps me. The major takeaway is quite simply, if you're in the final circle and you need to heal, protect yourself. If you don't protect yourself, you're dead. Well, that does it for this episode of Fortnite Rewind. If you've enjoyed it, hit the like button. If you want to see more content, hit subscribe, and you'll be notified when uh, more content's available. And as always, have a great day if you want to.